I just want to demonstrate how easy it is to install some docked object barrier to a standard handrail, sort of a handrail you see on any industrial site. Um, so this is the mesh, we've got our bucket here with some parts in it and basically an impact gun with a hex head on it for doing up some texture. So it's pretty simple, very basic to install, you don't need a lot of equipment. Just make yourself a little jig uh, and mark on it where you want the clips to, to sit. I just sit that on top of the, the kick rail there and just put a little pencil mark there and there. And they can put on these clips and all they need to do is wrap the clip, clip around like that. And as you can see, it'll just stay there, it won't fall off. It may slide down, but it'll stop, but it won't fall off to the other side so it doesn't become a dropped object. So on each staunchet, we have two clips. And on the mid rail, we have one clip. Get yourself one of these hex head drivers and make sure it's magnetic. And that way, your tech screws won't drop out and uh, become a drop dog there. This line, that was my pencil mark. I've sort of got it halfway through. Rotate so that face is running parallel with the handrails. Yep. So just bring them together, use uh, some vice grips, and then basically put a couple of text screws. These are pre drilled holes for your text screws. Once you've got one in, take the vice grips off and do the second one. So now you can see those top tech screws are through, those two surfaces have come together and that's what you're going to mount your mesh up to. So now you can see I've got the staunchion and mid rail clamps firmly attached and that's now ready to present the mesh and mount the mesh onto the hand rail. Rest the mesh onto the kick rail. That'll just keep it in position. And all you need to do is line it up so you can find one that basically you get coverage of two wires on your mesh. So that one looks pretty good. I'm going to go there. line it up okay so that's your mid rail secure uh, sitting nice and even on the kick rail and now you can do the same with the staunchions and we're covering two wires there and we'll do that one up there I'll do the bottom one as well before I do them up tight. There you have it. So that panel is now mounted on there and that will prevent any dropped objects falling from your platform over the side. There's a couple other benefits with this, and that is, in some cases, people, and they shouldn't, but they do, they use this mid rail to step onto, to reach up high. So this now prevents anybody from getting a foothold, and stops them from getting up higher than they should be, so they can fall over potentially. But that's how easy it is to mount the panel. It's can solid, galvanized mesh, um, will last outside and it's made for industrial use.